I had originally planned to release this video closer to when the second season of The Shield Hero was ending, but that didn't happen. Today we're building the Cardinal Shield from The Rising of the Shield Hero. We're going to model, print, and metal cast it. Then we're going to add some electronics. Let's get started. First thing is a good old fashioned modeling session. We made it as accurate as we could given that the shield literally changes sizes to fit the need, but the travel size of the shield takes up about the space in between Naofumi's elbow and above his wrist. We also modeled the green bulb in the middle, but we're going to print this separately out of resin. Alright, we're done with that. Now we can finally print it. It took me dozens of tries to print it correctly, but we finally got it right. We're sanding down the print some to reduce the visibility of the lines. Now it's time to cast it out of metal. First step is to melt down some recycled aluminum ingots. And while those melt, we're going to make the mold with sand casting, packing the sand over the 3D part and mashing it down. Then we'll remove the original and make sure that there's a pore hole. Time to pour in the metal. And finally, the moment of truth. Before we move on, I want to show you a failed pour that I think ended up actually looking really cool. It failed due to the pour hole being too small and the metal hardening before it flowed all the way through and filled up the mold. Alright, now we just need to polish and sand it a little bit. Now we're ready to throw some paint onto the recesses. Now let's get this green gem printed and clean it off. With that done, we're ready to attach the electronics. We're adding a battery pack, a switch for control, and two green LEDs on either side. Now let's flip it over and throw the gym into it. Now 
And finally, let's glue some handles on for control. <laughs> 